Welcome to the World Drone Market Channel. In today's video we will share our experience testing the new UniR C7 Pro in combination with other C products during an actual flight. Products used in this flight assembly. UniR C7 Pro, C RTK, CN7, CF9P base station, are FD900X. First, use the CF9P base to acquire satellites. Connect the base station antenna to the feeder cable, then connect the feeder cable to the F9P module. Use a USB cable to connect the F9P module to the computer. Open the Mission Planner Ground Station software, go to the Setup Interface, click on Optional Hardware, then click on RTK GPS Inject. Select the port for the base station, click Connect and wait for the satellite acquisition to complete. Once all five indicators in the RTCM box turn green, the satellite acquisition is complete. Next, save the acquired satellite address. Connect the computer to the 900X data transmission module. When both telemetry modules are flashing red, it indicates that the two modules are successfully connected. and click Use for the saved address. Return to the flight interface and you will see that the GPS is now in RTK mode. Then for the pre-flight preparation start by not installing the propellers. Turn on the remote controller and open the ground station interface to check if the flight modes can switch normally. Next, unlock the motors and check if the motor directions are accurate.
Finally, install the propellers. The UniRC 7 Pro supports dual band frequencies. Before takeoff, we can select the frequency through the ground station. After the test flight, our pilot reported the following experience with the UniRC 7 Pro. The UniRC 7 Pro demonstrated precise and quick response to joystick inputs. The control felt smooth and fluid, making the drone easy to maneuver. There was zero latency with no noticeable delay between joystick inputs and the drone's actions, providing a seamless flying experience. Paired with the CRTK, the drone returned to its takeoff point and landed accurately and steadily. Thank you all for watching. For more content be sure to follow the World Drone Market channel. We look forward to seeing you in the next video.